Good morning, boys and girls. It's Miss Tarwater. Today, we're going to practice writing rhythms. So we have learned how to say and speak and sing a lot of different rhythms in music class, but today we're gonna to practice writing them. So what you need today, you need to get out some paper and a pencil, markers, or crayons. You can use anything you want to write with. I have a marker today, but you can use whatever you'd like to write with um, so you can practice writing your music today. All right. So let's go over those rhythms that we have learned so far in music class this year. So we know ta, right? For sure. We say that one a lot. We sing and speak that one a lot. And ta can look like this. It can look like this, or it can be flipped upside down. So both of these rhythms are ta. I'm going to say four ta's. Will you say them after me? Ta, ta, ta. Ta. Ta, 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 ta. Good job. So for every one clap or stomp or snap that I have, there's one ta. Good job. Now let's move down to the next one. So when we have two together like this, this is TT. So I'll say TTs and then you say them after me. TT, 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 TT. T T T T T T T T. Good job. So for every one stomp or clap or snap, there are two T T's. Try that one more time. My turn first, then your turn. T T T T T T T T. T T T T T T T T. Good job. Awesome work. Now. Let's switch to our next. Here are the other rhythms we know. So remember this one is to, to. It kind of looks like ta, doesn't it? The only difference between to and ta when you're looking at it is that ta has the circle colored in, but to has an open circle, not colored in. So let's count to. Let's see how that one goes. It goes to, to. So for every two claps or snaps or stomps, there's one toe. I'll go first and then you go after me. Ready? Here I go. Toe, toe. Toe, toe. Nicely done, guys. All right, and let's move on to our last one. Our last one is a little bit different. This one is called shh. Awesome. That is shh, good job. So this is called a rest, and that means that we don't say a note, we don't sing a note, we just go shh on that note or that space, good job. So um, let's practice doing that one. It goes like this, shh, 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 shh. Shh, 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 shh. Awesome, now let's move on to writing our rhythms. So let's practice writing ta and tt first. So remember that ta can look like this. I'm gonna draw a circle, color it in, and then I'm gonna give it a big, long stem like that. And the stem can point up or the stem can point down. So if I start here with my circle, color it in, and then I can give it a stem that points down. So the stem can point up or the stem can point down. Either one is right. Just be sure you color in that circle. So let's practice again. Draw a circle, color it in, stay inside those lines, and then give it a long stem, like a flower. Let's try another one. Color in the circle, and give it a long stem. Awesome, we just wrote ta, 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 ta. Try it with me. Ready, go. Ta, 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 ta. Awesome. Now let's practice writing TT. So TT can go two ways. I need to take two of the ta's and put them together to make a TT. So I'm gonna start here. I'm gonna draw two circles and color them in. And I'm gonna kind of put those close together. I don't want them to be too far apart. 
because they walk together. Give them their stems, and then I'm going to connect those stems so they're joined up. Awesome. Now let's flip them upside down. Let's try it this way. I'm going to start down here. I'm going to draw two circles and color them in. Then I'm going to give them their stems and connect them together. Join them up. Let's try again. Color in the circle. Give them their stems and join them up. One more time. Color in those circles. Give them their stems and join them up. Awesome work, boys and girls. Let's sing, let's say this one. T T T T T T T T your turn ready go T T T T T T T T awesome job do you think we can say all of our notes let's start here follow my finger and see if you can say all of those notes with me one two here we go ta 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 T T T T T T T T nicely done. All right, let's move on to our next rhythms. Toe and sh. Let's practice writing toe and sh today. All right, so I'm gonna start with toe and I'm gonna start by drawing an open circle. So I am not gonna color this in for toe. I'm gonna keep it open, but I am still gonna give him a stem. Just like I did for ta, I just keep the circle open. Let's do it again. I'm gonna flip it upside down this time. Open circle, give him a stem. Again, open circle and give him a stem. One more time. Open circle and give him a stem. Good job, let's say those. Toe, 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 toe. One more time. One, two, here you go. Toe. Toe, toe, toe. Good job, boys and girls. Now, I'm gonna draw a sh down here at the bottom, and I want you to see how that looks. So this one is a little bit tricky, but there is an easy way to do it. So I'm gonna draw a sideways M. I'm gonna turn my paper to do it. I'm gonna start with an M, just like that. Now I'm gonna turn my paper back around, and I'm gonna draw a C right here. So it's like an M and a C connected. Let's try one more time. Let's turn my paper, draw an M, turn my paper back around, and draw a C. Now let's see if I can do that M sideways. I did it. And then draw the C. Good job, boys and girls. Let's say those sh together. Ready? Sh, 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 sh. Ready, go. Sh, 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 sh. Now let's practice saying our whole page together. Follow my finger. Here we go. Ready, and toe, 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 toe. Sh, 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 sh. One more time, go. Toe, toe. Toe, toe, sh, 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 sh. Awesome job, boys and girls. So I'm gonna write some music. You can copy mine today, and then after that, you can start to write your own music. Let's try it. I'm gonna start with a ta. So for a ta, do I keep it open or do I color it in? Right, I color it in. Thank you for telling me. Awesome. So I color it in for Ta and I give him a stem. All right, so I've got Ta. I think next I want to do a Sh. So I'm going to draw my sideways M and then give it a C. Okay. All right, now I'm going to do two TTs together. Do I color those circles in or do I leave them open? You're right, I color them in. Good job memorizing that, awesome. So 
I'm going to color those two in, give them their stems, and then for TT, I need to join them up. So I'm going to connect them together. I think next I'll do a ta. And I'm going to flip him upside down. So I'm going to color it in just like I did over there for ta. Awesome. Now I'm going to come down here to do my next one. And I think I'll start with toe this time. So for toe, open circle or colored in circle? You're right, it's an open circle, good job. So I'm gonna give it a stem for toe, toe, open circle with a stem, good job. And I think next I'll do another TT. So I'm gonna turn those upside down this time too. So color them in, give them their stems and join them up. And I think I'll finish with a ta. So there's my music that I wrote today. Let's practice saying it together. Follow my finger. We'll go slow. Here we go. Ready? And ta, sh, ti, ti, ta, to, ti, ti, ta. Good job. Try it again with me. Ready? Go. Ta, sh, ti, ti, ta, to, ti, ti, ta. Good job. One more time. Ta, sh, ti, ti, ta, to, ti, ti, ta. Awesome job, boys and girls. Now, I hope today you will go and get some more paper and write your own music. I hope you have an awesome day, and I'll see you soon.